from Beloved Sparrow. And we'll get back to that tomorrow night. And do some American Truck Simulator. I'm just finishing setting up some stuff. But, uh... Figured I'd start the stream while I'm still setting it up. I'm going to try to visit my hometown of Coos Bay, Oregon, which I think should be should be fun. I guess it all depends on what your definition of fun is. <laughs> I might not have the uh, the same definition uh, as you. Here we go. Got to get the game going. And yeah, we're playing actually the multiplayer mod. I uh, Another streamer that I follow uh, was interested in potentially trying the multiplayer mod. And so I was thinking about it. And I'm going to give it a go too. Because I'm an American truck. So I can get used to simulating. It's, probably should hide. <laughs> Let's log again. And we're going to do the simulation with 599 people. Wow. That's a lot of people. Oh, you can't see that because I haven't selected it yet. <laughs> oh, there it is. No, it is up. Okay, cool. Let's uh, let's go ahead and log in here. I don't own any trucks or anything, but I have played for five hours and seventeen minutes. Well, let's play for some more. I do have all the current downloadable content, including uh, the newest one, Idaho, and so I'm really looking forward to that. Um, yeah. Okay. Let's get some music on too. I got the music in the game muted. Um, the menu music is a bit too loud, which is why one of the reasons why I haven't muted. Um, and I got that in my library. Got my playlist here of stream safe music. And I worry a bit about the uh, the music being in the game potentially. Oh, did I just put one? Oh, let's... Ah, uh, that might have been... I might not have saved the, uh, <laughs> the playlist completely. And if you are watching, I would absolutely love to have you uh, chat with me while I'm on the road. There we go. A little bit of stream safe electronic music. Let's see. Oh, and we got a. There are some big rigs, you could say. I guess so. Got a new follower, Sailor Zan. Thank you very much for the follow, Zan. I really do appreciate it. Going to get the stream up on my phone, and we'll get to driving. I'll do that. We're almost halfway to the 50 needed, so we can uh, start monetizing. So yeah, welcome sailors in. I appreciate you. Let's take a look at some truck upgrades. I can buy nuts. <laughs> I wish it was actual truck nuts. 
I'll probably wait until I actually have my own truck to do any of that. And I don't think I can buy much of a truck for what? What do we got? Eighty-seven or sixty-six thousand dollars? It's gonna be real, real shitty uh, upgrades for, or, or real shitty truck for, <laughs> for that little amount of money. Yeah, same thing with the, with the trailers. Let's go ahead and see if we can find a. Find El Trabajo. So I'm looking. Huh? No. No. I was afraid I was talking too loud. Okay, cool. Oh, here we go. Coos Bay to Astoria. Perfect. Let's go ahead and start in Coos Bay. This is exciting. This is the town that I grew up in. It's raining, of course, because it's Coos Bay. All right, let's get going. Turn on your headlights. You will be kicked. How do I, I don't know how to turn the headlights on. Stop engine. I gotta have my headlights on or they're gonna kick me. <laughs> wow. I've not played it online before. That is very intense. Mouse cursor. Looks like the mouse cursor is not getting picked up. That's good. Okay, looks like the lights are on. <laughs> yep, this is Coos Bay for sure. Uh, I have the headlights on. I'm getting like really bad lag right now. It's nice to see the stream is really working out right now. Of course, as some of you may know, and by some of you I mean everybody who's probably watching the stream right now, knows that in real life I actually have a B-class commercial license. So, this isn't completely foreign, big vehicle. Uh, obviously, this is a bit different. Are my headlights on? I feel like my headlights are on. Before we set them to defaults. Yeah. yeah, light modes. L. Yeah, okay. I want to make sure the controls are set up proper. Why is it... Sh why is it not showing my... Controller. I've been having a really weird thing with two controllers showing up, even though I've only got one installed.
which is very strange. If you don't know, I use a online gaming service called Shadow, and it does usually work very well. So it's odd that I ha I'm having this kind of a problem. That's weird, but it is not showing my controller. Anyway. I'm sorry about the... the technical problems here. I'm really excited to show off my... Ridiculous hometown. Oh, I think we need the input wizard. <clears throat> there we go. Let's move that out of the way. Oh, I am not plugged in either. That might be the res that might be why we're having lag issues. My laptop doesn't do so hot on uh, there we go. When we have only <laughs> leave that alone. Only on battery. And the battery doesn't last very long either. Anyway, let's get back to the game. Maybe I'll figure it out as I go. There we go. Got the lights on. Okay. This place is certainly like Walmart. Of course, Coos Bay has a Walmart. It does not... Uh, does not have a Carl's Jr. And it didn't have a Starbucks until after I moved. <laughs> Which is pretty wild. There we go. Yeah, that is pretty wild. Oh, I love your uh, the little emote. It's in the chat. Okay. Okay, so that's our return signal. Oh, we gotta hurry though. We are taking a lot of time. Oh, uh oh. This is bad. <laughs> Turn around here. Wait, I also oh, I cannot do that. Personally, it's not They're really strict. I want that other mirror on too. I like random road events. Let's move let's get that up here. God, there's so many options. It's a bit ridiculous. Oh, maybe it's a button.
Show hide. Yeah, F2. Perfect. There. That's what I want. Oh, I, oh, I don't want to. I don't want to knock the trailer over. Gotta be very careful. There we go. There we go. I turn the wipers on. W? No. Different camera modes. A lot of different camera modes. That's the lights. There we go. There we go. Now we're cooking with gas. All right, Walbert. Heading on up to Astoria. That's the town where uh, the classic movie that I actually finally seen, The Goonies. Uh was uh was filmed. So that's pretty exciting. Waiting for the old, the old red light. And oh no, nope, I don't want to turn. I'm in the wrong lane. Sorry. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh yeah, there we go. How is that a red light violation? <sighs> Dang it. <laughs> oh well. Gotta make sure not to speed. Oh boy. This is definitely Coos Bay. It's cool that I was able to find a route that starts in Coos Bay. I feel really good about that. Here we go. Not a lot of traffic right now, but that makes sense. It is 3 o'clock in the morning. And if I recall, and I think it's right there, they modeled, yep, there it is, the tallest building in Coos Bay, the Tioga Building. <laughs> it's 10 stories. So that's pretty cool. I remember the first time I went in there, and I'd not really been in any tall buildings ever. I had a friend who... Uh, lived up there. Yeah, let's go outside the truck for a little while. I had a friend who lived up there, and it was really cool. Like, it's the first time I'd ever been in a building that was, like, more than, like, three stories. You know, or at least relatively high up. I think I was, like, we were on, like, the eighth floor or something. Oh, whoa. Gotta be going 20... Highway 101, the Pacific Coast Highway. Oh, yeah, and, and the road actually does this. Divergence. God, 20 miles an hour is slow. Oh, okay. The speed limit in the city is 45. But... that do? Oh, that brings up the map. Okay. Looks like I have been on this highway before. Or no, that's my current highway. Maybe I haven't. I've been on all the yellow ones. That might be the furniture warehouse I used to work in. It sure looks like it. It's in the right place, too. 
That's pretty cool. Oh, I was so buff back then. I'm glad I'm not now. Oh, whoop, I have to mind the speed limit. I think I've got the British uh, navigation on. Okay, we've got cruise control on. Let me see, maybe there's my high beams. I was supposed to stop for railroad crossing. I don't know how to put on. We're just gonna we're just gonna click it really fast like that. All right. <laughs> I don't think that matters. I don't know how to put on my four ways. Now we're gonna be crossing the McCullough Bridge, which. Which is a very beautiful bridge designed by well, that's it's the namesake bridge. I forget the f the, the first name of the person. It's probably like whoop, oh gosh, oh I know. It's probably like Charles McCullough or something like that. But there's bridges all up and down the Oregon coast that look just like this. What is this? Thirty-five. We'll do a couple miles over. That's usually fine. Ah, and the beautiful green trees. Can't really see the bay, but it does look to be modeled relatively accurately. We'll also pass through Newport and possibly Seaside? Okay, now we can go up to 55. I got the cruise control back on. Now we just settle in. And stay in our lane. Oh wait, okay, I thought I had cruise control on. Or maybe I do, and we're just going up an ever so slight incline, and <laughs> that's just what happens with these. Every city I've ever lived in, besides Philadelphia, is 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 in this game as a city you can drive to. <laughs> Which is pretty cool. It also means I haven't lived too many places. Now cruise control is on. Lighthouse. A lot of beautiful... Whoa! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> A lot of very beautiful lighthouses on the Oregon coast. Go backwards. Come on. Maybe moving the differential. Oh, there we go. I've driven vehicles with differential lock, but I do not remember what exactly it does. Oh boy. Don't want to have to call a tow truck. Not sure why I can't back up. I feel like I've got plenty of room. Oh, there we go. We're back. Okay, let's just forget that little, little episode ever happened. Just because the speed limit is... is, is <laughs> 55 does not mean you should be going 55. <laughs> oh, I 
it's so dark, it's so hard to see anything. We've only got three hours to get there, though. So, we gotta put the pedal down. No time to stop at the rest area and rest, which is what I would like to do. <laughs> yeah, nothing happened. Also, because I've had a uh, a uh, whiskey and Pepsi, I'm hypothetically drink driving. So, and it shows. Oh God! <laughs> oh. I haven't had that much to drink though. It's a beautiful Pacific Ocean. Yeah, I have driven on Highway 101 at this time of day in real life. Time of night, I guess. And uh, it looks exactly like this. Yeah, there was nothing to see here, Ossifer. Oh, and we go 65 now. Though I do not recommend it. <laughs> now apparently we can only go 55 now. So, that's good. You know what I think might help? When I get a chance, I'm gonna change the field of view to be give me a wider field of view. Wish I had my ultra wide monitor. That would really that'd really be cool. I think that's the real road hazard number. Wow, that's dorky. Why do I know that? Ah, Newport. Home of the Oregon Coast Aquarium. Where Keiko, the whale from Free Willy, was at before uh, she was set free. We went and saw her, actually, in 1994. <laughs> Oh, yeah, this looks like Newport for sure. Oh, any of these Oregon Coast towns look just like this. <sighs> Coos Bay is the only one that looks really different. I guess Astoria does, too. Traffic still. We're playing online with 500 other people. Guess the West Coast is a big place. Yeah, of course, the only city I have lived in that they don't have is Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, which. Uh, they probably won't have for a while, as the next DLC is uh, Colorado. So they're kind of getting there. I doubt they're going to do a beeline directly, you know, uh, you know, Colorado, Nebraska, uh, Arkansas, you know, like all the way across the East Coast. I severely doubt that. I, I think they're going to do something like... Montana, or ne something like that next. 
See, see this, how this bridge is very similar to the last one? Same designer. In fact, if you head south, there are also bridges like this down there. Portland doesn't have any bridges f f uh, by this person. Who, for the lack of uh, knowing for sure, will call Robert McCullough. I feel like that's just... That's just a safe assumption. Or maybe it's like G Gordon McCullough. <laughs> I don't know. I know it's McCullough. You know, they say the hardest part of streaming is coming up with things to say during the quiet moments. And the thing about uh, Truck Simulator is there's only quiet moments, basically. I mean, unless you crash, like I totally didn't do. There we go. I'll okay, finally go 35. Cool. I still haven't seen any vehicles. All. I wonder if the online one doesn't have any vehicles. Other than the, uh, the, uh, trucks. Equinahead Historic Lighthouse. Nice. Looks like you could even go that way, but we're not heading that way. Now we're entering 55, and we're going down to one lane. That's also very common on the Pacific Coast Highway in Oregon. There we go. Let's slow down a bit. Now we're getting a 45 mile an hour turn here. With big vehicles, I, uh, especially when I'm not comfortable with the driving conditions, I try to stay at or under the recommended turning speed limit. Pacific City. Cool. And of course, the thing to remember about speed limits is that's, well, I guess there's some cars there, that, that, that that is the speed limit under ideal conditions. Night and rain do not call ideal conditions. Okay, goodbye Pacific City. We entered it and left as quickly as possible. <laughs> feel like I've got a little more control of how the truck feels now. There's a viewpoint coming up. 
Yeah, there's nobody to crash into. Yeah, it's weird. I'm really wondering if the multiplayer mod just doesn't have vehicles besides the players. I mean, 500 is... 500 players, or, or up to 1,000 players, is pretty, pretty impressive. Getting the hang of it a little more here. <laughs> I guess so. down a bit here. Okay, we're well, going to slow down. Still got an hour. That's not bad, though. We're 40 miles out. We're making good time. I think it's due there by three some. <sighs> I played this a lot when the pandemic first began. I would, I drove the route that I drove in real life in in the bus. You know, Salt Lake to St. George and back. <laughs> <laughs> Which is, you know, I think says a lot about how big of a dork I am. <laughs> the lighting is really good too. Like the the reflecti uh, reflectivity of the science looks great. Very curvy. Kind of like, kind of like, uh, kind of like Zen. <laughs> I don't usually say that about my viewers, but I know enough about you to uh, be able to say that. <laughs> Just coasting now. That's interesting. It's taking a minute for the speed to go down. Ah, you know how I like making you blush. And there's another Walbert, but it's oh, in Astoria, perfect. But it's not the the one I'm looking for. I might be going to a distribution center. Oh, we gotta mind that speed limit. Maybe we'll see more trucks as we get to the interstate. <clears throat> uh, another McCullough <coughs> designed bridge. I 
Now this one might not be designed by McCullough. There is one in Astoria that is, so. <sighs> oh, we're going to Dry Guts. I thought we were going to Walbert. US 30 to Portland. Done that road a lot of times. Welcome to Astoria. Okay. Here we go. Looking good. Our speed limit is very low here. I'll fake it. There we go. I don't think you actually have to do that, but I want to do it. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa, Nelly. All right. Uh, let's play it safe. Very safe, apparently, because it just needs me to put it right here. <laughs> Conde. That's cool. Whoop, I did press a oh, Y button on the controller. There we go, we did it. A time taken 264,292 hours and 11 minutes. <laughs> what? Oh no. Oh no. How is that late? That's not late. What? What is that? I lost all the money because I was 264,000 hours late. <laughs> well, that's not fair. Two <laughs> yeah, that doesn't... Just doesn't seem right. All right, let's try looking in a more peopley area. <laughs> what I tend to like to do, actually, is go from where I'm at to the next place. Curious, let's see. We're in Astoria. Not the destination. We want the origin. No. Okay, so there is no origin there. That's fine. Let's find... Yeah, I hope they weren't perishable either. I apparently had hundreds of generations. I Salt Lake to Coos Bay. Plows. They don't need plows in Coos Bay. They need them in Salt Lake. <laughs> Let's see. I've... 
How about Salt Lake Divernal? That'll be fun. <laughs> it's not very far. Okay, here we go. I actually I have been to Vernal now that I think about it. Ooh, a bit bumpy. Yeah, because I think... Is Vernal off of I-80? I think it's off of I-80. And of course, I've driven to Wyoming on I-80. Well, actually, I've driven to Chicago on I-80, so it's a little farther than... <laughs> Can I, is this the way I need to go? This is a very complicated way to get out of here. to get my A class, so I suppose this is good experience. I could go in there and say, yeah, but I've played hours and hours of American Truck Simulator, so I'm ready. Oh, God. Fixy <laughs> more grid system. Yeah. I don't think we're... Do I want to go that way? Guess... No, I don't think I do. Well, we must be on the outskirts of Salt Lake. I need to watch my speed. Where? Yeah, where are we? Or maybe we're in Vernal. Let me see. No, we're outside of Salt Lake. Let me see here. Come on. Oh, I had to right mouse click. 
Yeah, we're outside of Salt Lake. We're somewhere. Like, out at, uh... Hey! How are you doing? Oh, it's Lorcan. New gender who dis? I'm driving from Salt Lake to Vernal. Very excited. Make this smaller. Oh, that's not what I want. Ah! Whoa, stop. <sighs> oh my god, the computer keeps crapping out. Giving his pants around the low of the stream. Oh no. I'm sorry. Whoa. By the way, uh, new gender, I would love it if you were my 25th follower. As I'd be halfway there, and it'd be very, be very special for somebody I know to be my halfway there. Halfway to getting, uh, a, I keep wanting to call it associate, affiliate. Obviously, you don't have to. <laughs> Where? Yeah, I, th I think we're leaving called, uh, uh Kennecott. Caldecott. <laughs> that would be a, a book uh, uh, award for children's books. <laughs> we have a trailer full of children's books. That's what it is. Apparently, you can get uh, Morgan Freeman's voice uh, for the satnav, which I think sounds pretty cool. Looking a little more familiar now. It looks like a city, at least. Turn on my wipers. Well, I hope your computer stops crapping out. So you can watch the, the interestingness that is what I'm doing. 151. 5400 West, I think it says. That's cool. We're not going to get on I-15, unfortunately. It did look West Valley-ish, yeah. Oh, we are getting on I-15. We're getting on I-15 north.
Oh, yeah, I recognize these walls. Uh-oh. Hit my trailer. I totally recognize these walls. That's super cool. And our next exit is I-80. So... Fuck Murray, apparently. <laughs> I mean, there's the 2100 South Freeway. That's cool. will be coming up uh, right around the time I get to Vernal at this rate. Maybe we'll get to see if there are actually any cars. If not, that's kind of a shame. It makes the game feel really empty. Also makes it a lot easier. <laughs> Heber City, Vernal. Oh, that's where we're going. Summit County. <laughs> okay, we got a yield sign here. Check and make sure there's no traffic coming, which there's not. Oh, I ran over a sign. <laughs> Well, oh, ah! Gotta keep my hands on the wheel. <laughs> Maybe there's a way. Oh, let me stop here. Maybe there's a way to turn traffic on. Maybe it's maybe it's an option. I'd really rather have traffic on. Show <laughs> truck limit, keep route advisor, heavy cargo map one, map navigation, random road events. See, I, I I want those on. I like that. Rain probably depends on for map truck settings. Camera settings, regional settings. No, it'd be there. Okay. Maybe I'm just uh, a bitch who's asking too many questions. <laughs> yeah, I think I just might be a bitch who's asking too many questions. I think US 40 was where I got a speeding ticket. Wasatch County, yeah. That's where I got a speeding ticket. <laughs> I think it was this very road. And look, I'm speeding right now. You think I would have learned my lesson? Oh yeah, this is definitely Heber City. This is a very Heber City. Yeah, I was right out of out, right outside of Heber City where I got uh, my speeding ticket, and I'm absolutely uh, I was speeding through the exact same place on the game. <laughs> Whoops. Yeah, yeah, there are no cops. Yeah, what's what's the worst that's gonna happen? I I'll have to go back to the uh, Pride Center and volunteer more. <laughs> no, they'll probably. Oh, oh, hey, it's uh, the Sinclair dinosaur. 
That's cool. Dino. Is that a second part of station? Nope, it's just that green station. It does almost look like a BP, though. But no, that's the dinosaur. That's so cool. So they didn't model the actual Sinclair station. A point of entry. Does that mean I gotta go through the... Bloody, uh... Scales? Maybe not. No magic, just science. That doesn't sound like Utah at all. <laughs> it's... It's really, it's rather, that's, I guess that's one of the, the most, the best things about living in Utah is there's just so many things to make fun of here. It's, it's a very, like, absurd place in a lot of ways. <laughs> I wish they had a mod where you could drive, right? Ah! <laughs> I wish they had a mod where you could drive, uh like, sports cars in the game, that'd be really cool. <laughs> they don't, I've looked for it. <laughs> I suppose that would require a uh, huge rewrite of the physics model. <laughs> it's clearly not meant for you to be driving a Ferrari. Still have two hours and four minutes. It's just a lot of, a lot of driving at the speed limit. I want to take a, a, in real life, I, I this uh, maybe when the pandemic uh, lifts, you know, it gets easier. Um, or, you know, there's a vaccine. I want to go visit New Mexico. It seems like a cool place. Go to Four Corners, you know, like a moron. Okay, we're still good on fuel. Helps that they give you a different truck every time. <sighs> Until you buy your own. I bet in I on I-15 in northern Utah they have those those stupid signs that say like drowsy drivers pull over next exit. <laughs> They're very doofy Utah signs. One hour, 24 minutes. Someday they might have a video game where you're able to drive a real truck. Wouldn't that be wild? <laughs> it's one to one scale and it's a real truck. Don't fuck up. <laughs> du Duchesney. Du is that how you say Duchesne? Du du Duchesne. Du Duchesne. Du Duchesney. I'm going to say it that way. <laughs> I'm not from Utah. Price? Oh, there's a, there's a beautiful place. Love fucking Price. Is that a restaurant called iFlop? <laughs> yeah, it totally is. Shit, 
Let's go to iFlop. <laughs> it's, it's like the same logo and everything. No, I can't go there because I'm 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 driving a route. Oh yeah, yeah, you you mind your business, okay? GPS, Jeepus. Well, to be fair about getting a speeding ticket, I I did end up losing what what uh, was probably one of the coolest jobs I've ever had. At least as far as, like, being able to tell people that's what you do. Driving people to a casino and getting to play the slots for free. Like, I don't know. That's pretty fucking cool. Yeah, and the free buffet. Yeah. Ah. Oh. oh, I want the free buffet. It wasn't great. But uh, it was free. So it was the best buffet in the world. <laughs> Since you can hear me in person, you're a spiky kid. That's good to see you again. Uh, since you can hear me in person, uh, you can probably respond quicker than most others can. <laughs> I guess so far this is a, uh, a friends-only uh, chat or a stream. I did spread the word to places, not on Facebook or Twitter this time, but I'm just afraid everybody's gonna get sick of my shit. I maybe I'll respond quickly, but that doesn't mean I care to. That's true. Most of what I'm saying is not really worth a response. So, got another 20, 18 miles here. I've started doing my Steam games out of order, but that's fine. I'm actually, like, keeping track of the number. So, like, this is number 11. It's because I, uh, I have a game of Age of Empires 2 that I need to finish. And I was doing really shitty, so I'm not sure if I want to. I, mean, I guess I don't have to finish it, but I said in the stream I would to all of the person that was watching it. <laughs> yeah, it was literally one person, right. It was uh, uh, some geek. That's their name, uh, their, their screen name, not, not, not uh, I'm not just talking about some, like, rando geek. I mean, it is a rando geek, but it's some uh, geek rando person. So, uh, Sailor Zan, have you seen any of Discovery? Oh, no, you... Do you watch Discovery? I forgot if you've watched Discovery or not. I've only... I've still only seen the first episode of, uh, Discovery Season 3. I need to... need to watch some more tomorrow. I'm very excited about the trans and the... Uh-oh. Oh. The trans and the non-binary characters didn't swing out wide enough. There's a there's a PA for me. You yeah you've only seen the first half of season one. You should watch season three. It, it is literally like with the exception of like the, the 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 you know it's like the same characters for the most part. It's like a brand new start. Uh, Discovery season three. It's, uh, it's anus, a, a, anus tart, anus start, <laughs> if you will. <laughs> it's almost as good as a nalrapist. <laughs> all right, let's see what we got here. Uh, all right. Where do you want 
me? Where do you want me? I don't know the song. I just remember there's a song with those words. It kind of goes like that, but I'm probably way off. Because I'm not hip to the jive. Do I want to be over there? Yeah, I think I want to be over th over there. Not over there, but over, over here. That's what I get for being a an asshole. I'm trying to show off to my friends. My 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 friendos. Oh wait. Ah. Uh, maybe that's not what I want. I don't know. I don't even know. Oh, wait. It is in my mirror. They want me right... Oh, wait, no, no. no. That, that's, that's the start where I came in and I got to choose. Okay. Oh, I think we're going to jackknife. Or hit something. Nope, we're good. I guess we're delivering... delivering oil or something? <laughs> oh, screw it. <laughs> Can, how do I finish this? I don't even, I don't even know where they want me. Uh, frack tank. Ooh, maybe I shouldn't have taken that down. How do I finish it? I want to finish it. I'm done. I don't, I don't want to do this anymore. Okay, there we go. Perfect. We're done. All right, let's drive away. <laughs> I think we have to go back to the beginning part here. Just driving through the brush here. Come on. Oh, God. I get, uh, uh, oh, oh, it wants it right there. Okay, I can do that. I just have to go back to the damn trailer <laughs> that I left behind like an idiot. <laughs> This is why you uh, always look before you leap, which is not a thing that I, I ever, I ever do. Speaking of not looking before you leap, it is almost me and my wife's sixth wedding anniversary. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna be in the doghouse tonight. Uh, yes. <laughs> no, but seriously, uh, my wife is pretty cool. You know, I tend to get a v ah, shit. I tend to get a decent amount of views after the fact, and so that's why I still do this like common, this like running commentary. Uh, like last night, I actually got a new, uh, a new follower while I was asleep. Fancy that. I mean, wow, I knew you several months before I asked you. The fact that I proposed two weeks after the first date was neither here nor there. My, uh, my wife, uh, ladies and MBs. Oh, 
Slow down. Uh, why button? Because I heard like a, like a thunk, but I, I I think that was just in the music. Fifth wheel locked. Okay, perfect. I have it. Got it. You know me for. <laughs> I just don't know what's good for me. Do da, do da. Ah, okay, wants me right there. That's easy. That's a, that's a, that's a straight back up. Of course, I'm not really that good at straight anything. Oh, 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 whoa. Which is why I'm coming in at the complete wrong angle. That's good. Okay. Now. Oh, God. I, I hate this. I've done this before, but only in like a... Like a small... Like... U-Haul situation. Oh, no. I think that's... Is that right? I think that maybe... No, that is right. Oh, don't T-bone. Or, uh... Not T-bone. Jack and I. I just... I just... Let's see if I can, I can look out. I, I like that looking out. Okay, you know... I've got the trailer again. I think maybe I can just end it. Oh, shit. What I run into? Uh... I can't go backwards very much. Because I'll jackknife. There we go. Yeah, well, you know, screw it. I suck, we all know it. Oh, go a little more. A little more. Beautiful. Well, sound anyway. We're gonna. We're in a hurry. Okay, cool. Three hours and 18 minutes. That's much better instead of the 260,000 uh, hours <laughs> that it took us last time. Let's, let's see if we can get a job. That is on a major interest state. St. George, San Francisco. No. What about this one? St. George to Santa Maria. Yes, that's south on I-15 I to Los Angeles. Yes. Oh, it doesn't pay a lot, though, but I guess that's all right. Oh, here we go. Salt Lake to Bakersfield. That's 20 cents a mile. Or Salt Lake to Carson City. That's I-80. We'll do that. As I've driven uh, I-80. That becomes more interesting. <clears throat> Still raining. Raining in Coos Bay. Raining in Salt Lake. Raining in Vernal. I suppose it makes sense that it was raining in both Salt Lake and Vernal, is there? We're not terribly far away. But I mean. Raining in both. Well, I mean, it's always raining in Coos Bay, so. I suppose that's not that weird. Hoping that uh, Lorcan 
gonna stick around. They're a very popular person, and for good reason. <sighs> but what matters is that this is, this is going a long way to me getting my average of three people. So thank you for that. Then I could start working up to my hundred dollars that I have to get before they'll cash me out. So this time next year, if I keep it up, then maybe maybe it'll happen. Salt Lake International Center. Oh, I know where this is. I I, I did the bus route around here. For UTA. <laughs> I know exactly what this is. I'm scared to turn right on the red because the, they're going to ding me. Okay, that's green now. Yes. We are right off of Interstate 80 by the airport. I liked that route a lot. It had, had long breaks. <laughs> I, like the, I like the ones with the long breaks. <laughs> it can be people I know as long as they're watching. Because they want to know that people are going to watch me. Because people who are willing to watch me means that uh, they're going to watch the pre-roll ads. So, if you know what's good for you, Spiky Kidna, that's right, I'm threatening you. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. <laughs> uh, pretty sure intimidation is uh, against the Twitch terms of service. <laughs> oh, by the way, uh, Zan, I actually looked up the... Uh, that smokestack in Twilla, or I guess outside of Twilla, it's actually only the fourth tallest smokestack in the world. It is the tallest uh, west of the Mississippi, and the second tallest, uh, yeah, yeah, look it up. It's the second tallest in the Western Hemisphere. There's one in Pennsylvania. There it is right there. That's what reminded me of it. Uh, there's one in Pennsylvania that is literally two feet higher. It's two feet higher. You know I had to look it up. Not that I didn't believe you. It's that I, I just, I look up everything. And I'm, you know. Oh, I saw a rabbit or something. I'm just, just kind of weird that way. And it's like, it's in the top 50 freestanding structures in the world, which is pretty boss. There's, oh yeah, this is all looking very familiar. And we're averaging, this is the kind of get, uh, mileage you get on uh, trucks. I'm averaging 4.1 uh, miles per gallon. <laughs> That's why the tanks are so big. I think buses are relatively similar in that. Probably a little better. Because they're not as heavy. Also, given that at least transit buses, the uh, engine tends to be in the back, that might help a little bit. As they're real rear rear I mean these are also rear oh my god I can't I can't I cannot say that right now rear wheel drive rear wheel drive there we go I 
Actually, I talked to somebody from the UK the other day, and I mentioned that uh, I know somebody that used to live in the the uh, the rural and rural. <laughs> I just cannot say that, and I couldn't say it. I couldn't say it at all. I'm like, I'm like, I, I, it's just just like the most awkward fucking thing in the world. That is, that's a real thing too, on the way to Wendover. Hard to tell what it is. Squirrel. Whirl. 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 Did I get it? This point of entry. I've actually been through this point of entry in a commercial vehicle. Whoa. Whoa. Whirl. <laughs> oh, there's, a, there's an actual another driver. And they're, they're okay. So, oh, I, I, I got to pull in the way station. Okay. Hopefully there's... Oh, I guess there's no police around because it's, it's just online. I can't believe I always forget. Never mind, I'll. F Did that person say, never mind, I'll find a new brain? Here we go. Yeah, I have totally stopped this way station. That's fucking cool. Activate the icon. All right, cool. We're good. We used to have a mascot called Cyril the Whirl Squirrel. <laughs> oh God, that's terrible. <laughs> yeah, that's up there with the, with the road Jello. <laughs> the road Jello. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> The Wells Quo. <laughs> oh, yeah, it looks just like this as you're entering Wendover. There's these, like, cliffs that pretty sure they carved out to put the freeway. That's really cool. Yeah. Oh, yeah, here we are. Recreational center, that's the best they could do. Oh no, health, health center. Health, there's no health in Wendover. Oh yeah, there's the, the, uh, what is that, the Montego Bay. That is totally the Montego Bay. That is pretty damn cool. And if I had to sleep, it looks like I could even stop in Wendover. Concert hall. That's the pepper mill. That's cool. Whoa. <laughs> Should be paying more attention to the road, but I think that's pretty cool. Okay, yeah, that is totally the casino. That that would be the uh, the red. Uh, what is it? I I forget what that one's called. The red. Some some with a G. Red garter. There we go. I wanted to call it the Red Garnet. <laughs> well, I'll be. I'll be a monkey's distant cousin. You like that? Yeah, I'll share a common ancestor with. With great apes. <laughs> 80 is a good speed limit because I'm not even sure if this truck will go 80. Oh, we'll pass through. Um... Oh, where is it? Oh, oh, th this is familiar. That. That city with all the Basque people. Well, we'll know when we get there. And whenever I drive through Nevada, I always buy alcohol there. Because alcohol is way the... Winnemucca. That's right. Yes. Home to the, the Basque Festival. Which, if if uh, when COVID is not on, 
I would love to go visit there. In fact, you know, that's, that's a really big thing that COVID really drives home. is like, you just got to fucking go out there. You know? Not right now. Yeah, don't go out there right now. Don't be like the president. But like after, after it's all over. I've already said that I'm going to, I'm going to do an open, I'm going to go to an open mic night and tell my shitty jokes. And, you know, nobody's going to laugh. And that, that that's, act, I actually kind of prefer that. <laughs> it's like the jokes I used to put in my PowerPoint presentations when I was in high school and college. They were bad. And nobody laughed with me. So, <laughs> I think that's just kind of, you know, here's, here's the problem, though. If I say that, people are going to laugh at that. They're going to laugh at uh, not laughing, at people not laughing. And I don't think I can take it. I, I don't I think that I could take it Cause it took so long to bake it And I'll never have that recipe Oh, uh, okay, 75 here Oh no Oh no <laughs> It's so good Exactly the kind of crap I like. Oh, wait, this all looks very familiar. Oh, we got another way station coming up. I can bypass. Cool. Thank you. Actually, the last time I drove for the bus company I work for that I will not name because I'm telling a story about how they're kind of incompetent. Uh, <laughs> I, I was driving up to the uh, Bear Lake. Beautiful. It's absolutely gorgeous. And they did not tell me that there was a way station on the way. Uh, and they did, they never confirmed with me that I knew how to do the way station procedures. <laughs> Fortunately, I knew. Because I had worked at the casino bus driving job. And I had that way station... Outside of Wendover, oh, Elko, cool, Elko, nice, that I had to uh, stop at every time. <laughs> Do they not have Winnemucca? I cannot use pause when my truck is moving. Oh, hey, it's another truck. I'm going to get over. That's cool. It's kind of cool to know that even though there's no traffic, that all the people that I encounter in the game are real people. It's pretty damn cool. That person had a uh, Cyrillic name. So I would assume that... Okay, thanks for stopping by. I appreciate it, and I will talk to you later. Tomorrow night, it'll be back to Boo Loved Sparrow. Boo Loved Sparrow. And we'll play some more Amnesia, so... If you want, you're welcome to that. I'm going to take my hands off the wheel. There we go. Put my hands back on the wheel. <laughs> <laughs> Especially because I got another player behind me, and they can probably report me if I'm driving poorly. <laughs> I will talk to you soon. Yeah, one of the people that follow me uh, plays this game. Tet uh, Tetranama something, Tetranomicon or tet something like that. <laughs> I never, I can never remember their name. And so, but they have a wheel and like 
pedals and stuff. Like, they're way cooler than I am. Still got five hours and 13 minutes. Until we get to Carson City. Actually, we'll be going through another city that I've lived in. Ooh, spooky. Wait, that's not spooky. That's that's just... I already I did already mention that every city I've ever lived in is on this map besides Philadelphia. Yes, we'll be going to Reno, the city where I was a wee baby. So that's pretty cool. I've been back there exactly once uh, as an adult. And if I didn't have uh, children, I would have certainly been back there more. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to finish this uh, run, and then I'll be done. Just got to get to Carson City. Got another four hours and forty eight minutes until I get there. In game time, not not in real time. <laughs> That's probably like twenty minutes. Oh yeah, Winamaka, yeah. And Tupele. Oh, I love that. I love the Nevada drive. Going between Oregon and Utah. A little longer, but it's really cool being out in the middle of nowhere. And especially when I had that really fast car. Oh. <laughs> hmm. Doing donuts in a gravel lot. <laughs> it was the uh, fastest car in the world as far as I was concerned. That is, it was a rental car. Oh, there's Winamaka. Yay! Home to the Basques and liquor stores that I go to when I'm in Nevada. Oh, it's 65 here, and I'm going 80. <sighs> gotta be cool. Gotta play cool. We're not, uh... We're not being... I actually like that term. We're not being sus. I'm glad I know what it is because uh, now I, I'm glad I know what it is now because I see it everywhere. <laughs> Broken billboard. That's cool. It's very accurate. Three hours and 49 minutes. Look at there. 10.04, 10.03. So we are making time. It's always nice. A bit rare in real life. With traffic and the like. I, I mentioned traffic on the multiplayer mod website, so I'm a little curious why there's no traffic. I mean, besides other real-life drivers. I think next time I play this, I will probably play... the single-player version. Unless I'm playing with somebody I know. Like Tetronomicon. Now 
95 miles to go. And then, yeah. I'll be back home in Salt Lake. Maybe I'll do a route from uh, Carson City to uh, Sacramento. It's another place I flew to. Actually, in Sacramento, I haven't been to Sacramento on here, but the Sacramento that is on the crew is very well realized. So I'm hoping it's also well realized on here. I feel like the Portland is decently realized too. Maybe we'll see if we can get something from Sacramento or the Bay Area to uh, Portland, Seattle. That would be pretty cool. Oh yeah, we're definitely gaining time. Why are we getting like an hour? That was after the time the time change. Interesting fact about uh God I feel, I feel like I feel like Cliff Clavin. Uh from Cheers. Uh hey, uh Nom. That was an uh, interesting fact about uh West Wendover, Nevada. Uh it's that uh, it's the only part of Nevada that um, isn't in the in the um, uh, Pacific time zone. Of course, most of the facts he gives are wrong. <laughs> so, so maybe I should be like, it's uh, the only part of Nevada that's in the uh, Central time zone. <laughs> or it'd be even worse in uh, Greenwich Mean Time. <laughs> it's not that bad. The trucker. Oh, they used... I, th I think they, they tried to use the radio. The radio. <sighs> I've been driving what is essentially all night on the game. I think I like Trucking Simulator better than Flight Simulator because uh, it's not one-to-one -one scale like Flight Simulator is. <laughs> You're the new one. I'm glad that American Truck Simulator is not one-to-one -one scale. I would not want to spend the five hours or so that it takes to get to Reno from Salt Lake driving from Reno to Salt Lake. Or vice versa. I would not want to do that. In real life, it's a bit of a slog, but it's doable. Kind of like the... Okay, it's the 14 hours from Salt Lake to Eugene is more than a bit of a slog. It's... Uh, or 16 hours from Salt Lake to Keys Bay. It's uh, more than a bit of a slog. We're in Reno. Hey, yay, Reno. It's where I was a wee baby. Truckee, Sacramento, those all ring true. Wish you would step back from the ledge, my friend. Looks like we have our turn coming up. Fat times was on the last you. Oh, I remember that building from when I was in Reno. Uh, recently, not when I was a baby. I, I don't remember anything from that. And if you do not want to see me, you should not see that. I mean, I'm not going to get copyright struck for singing uh, music poorly. <laughs> yeah. 
fact about Nevada, it is the uh, Reno and, and uh, Las Vegas are the two largest cities in America that are not directly connected by an interstate freeway. We've got road works, so we better slow down. And 580, here we go. Boise and Coeur d'Alene are also examples of that. Uh, they're all connected by US-95, which is, of course, not a freeway. There are, there are plans to build a potential uh, Interstate 11, which would run from the Mexican border and connect uh, probably, what, Tucson, Phoenix... There's already freeway there. That's that's uh, what is that? It's not 14. It's 19 or something. It's the only freeway in America that uh, is on the metric system. See, look what you're missing. Trying to follow the rules. We're trying to be realistic about this. Okay. A little more than an hour left. And we'll be sitting pretty in Carson City. Carson City is, of course, the... Uh, Capital of Nevada, the Silver State, Battleborn. Became a state in 1861. Although there were no official battles uh, fought in Nevada, it is still, like they say, Battleborn. Very interesting state uh, demographically. Even though I only lived in Nevada for two months as a baby, that is where I was born. So if I ever moved back to Nevada, I would be in the minority of people who live in Nevada and were born in Nevada. That's quite rare. So that's, it's interesting. Forty-one minutes. U.S. fifty. I believe that's the loneliest road in America. <sighs> but that's not where we're going. Oh, we got another. Is that another? <laughs> that's cool. I like that safe travels. I would respond, but I do not know how. I would say 10-4, good buddy. <sighs> we getting off here? Does look like we are. Nineteen minutes left. Twelve miles. Yeah, this definitely looks like Nevada. I find there being something very beautiful about uh, Nevada. Okay, we 
our minding. We am I hearing some police thing? I can't. Oh, shit. Well, gotta go through now. <laughs> Yeah, this is the capital of Nevada. Very much a swing state. I feel like it's been traditionally Republican, but... Former Senate Majority Leader Harry Reid, uh, who's a Democrat, is, uh, he served from Nevada. So I think that's pretty interesting. Of course, the only state in the country with uh, legal prostitution. But, of course, uh, it is... Well, you, I guess it's not of course. But it it is not allowed in uh, the large counties. Population large. It is only allowed in the very rural counties. Population white, yes. <laughs> it's five white people. Okay, we're just finishing up now. Looks like we had another had another trucker. A couple truckers, a little convoy going. Yeah, it always looks like that. A movie based off a song. Yeah, I don't know if it's fun or not, but it's... <laughs> Smoking the Bandit is, is awesome. Uh, Convoy? I don't know. <laughs> oh, yeah, we can do that. And we're just finishing up now. Plant safe. We will get the extra wee bit of experience. Move, Jeff Air. Groovy. Move, Jeff Air. Some in interesting banter there. All right, grooving. <laughs> Guessing maybe they're not a convoy. But that will have to wait for another day. As we are done, though. So, I would like to thank Sailor, Sailor Zan for, once again, following. And anybody else who happens to be watching or watches this later, I'd like to thank you, too. Please follow. Um, it would mean a lot to me. But, yeah, I hope you have a wonderful night. And uh, if you're out on the open road, whether it's real or virtual, have safe travels. Bye.